Welcome to Comedian Catch Live. We got some great comedians coming to the stage tonight. Sorry, I'm gonna give a little bit more love than that. We ain't gotta let everybody know there's only three people here. We can pretend. If you clap real hard and start bouncing off the walls and shit, sound like other people's in here. So go ahead, clap real hard. Damn, you see that shit? You see that? That shit sound like we in a fucking stadium or some shit. Hell yeah. All right. Ten thousand people. All right, all right. Don't go to Brooklyn saying that so so. You're gonna piss off a lot of Haitians. <laughs> Haitians are gonna be like, what are you calling me? You call me that so so? Are you crazy? Are you crazy? I'm gonna do in your face. <laughs> What the fuck is in your face? No, I, this is true. I've, uh, I've, uh, I'm in a relationship now, and my, my new, we got off to a weird start. My new boyfriend has cancer. Uh, yeah, it's, yeah, no, that's totally true. Uh, it's weird, it's weird for me to hear myself say that word out loud. It's kind of scary, right? Um, boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> hey, how you doing, sweetie? Is this your first COVID test? I'm like, nah, this is my fifth test. She said, oh. So you're familiar with the procedure? <laughs> I said, yeah. She said, tilt your head back. I'm like, wait. <laughs> We're doing both nostrils twice. <laughs> you ever get the COVID test and then that one tear trickle down the side of your head? Hell yeah. Like, yo, there's some tissue there. You need some tissue, pussy. <laughs> one time my mama brought me home some high heel Air Force Ones, y'all. I hear you. I was like, yo, mom, you know these for girls, right? She told me, oh, you gonna wear whatever I give you. You ain't got no choice. Let me tell you something. Yeah, my mama had me at school working like I was a gazelle the first week. You feel me? Kind shit. All my friends said, damn, stuff, how you get tired with the girls for? I'm like, these, these heels, nigga. I had to bring over this girl, though. She was super toxic. I'm so in love with her. She's too toxic. She was always accusing me of cheating. And it's like, I was, but be positive. <laughs> <laughs> I was cheating a lot, you know? I was cheating like that's what you're supposed to do in a relationship. <laughs> Duh, fuck, I was cheating a lot, for real. Yeah, you know, I broke up with her like, bitch, you just gonna accuse me of shit I'm doing? I'm out here. <laughs> All these accurate accusations. 